Hello everyone, today I'm going to be taking on Barmano, the Lord of the Neanderthals, the cheeky guy who stole some sacred weapons from some oriental people living in the mountains. So he's going to be on the epic difficulty, but um, he's pretty much the same on normal, epic and legendary. The only difference is that he has more health on higher difficulties, so legendary will take him probably slightly longer to kill. I mean, unless you have an absolutely fantastically powerful character. So, let's begin then. Righty then. First of all, I'd advise you to clear out these other Neanderthals, these little guys here, because the last thing you want is for them to annoy you while you're trying to take on the big boss. Because one time I was trying to actually get one of those and he ran all the way back and that's when Barmano sprang out and stunned me and killed me. And I'll tell you how, you probably know how he kills you after he stuns you. Yeah, so you just lure them back there, kill them. And here he is. He has one deadly combo that he uses. He jumps up and screams, which stuns you. Like it seems like like that. And the safest way really is to just run around him in a circle like I'm doing here. I mean, this way you can pretty much guarantee he won't hit you. And once he has done his scream, then you can go in and just attack him like this and you know, like that. Because the thing is, when he stuns you, straight after, he gets some rocks to fall on you. See? Look at this. Can you see that? And do you know what saved me here? Stun resistance. Because that's the most important resistance against him. If I didn't have 80% stun resistance there, he would have dropped those rocks on me and I would have been a goner by now. So, oh, that was pretty easy. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it, the main strategy. You just run around him in circles, let him scream. Once he screamed, he obviously, it was obviously a time until he's asked again. So you can, in the meantime, you can attack him, basically. And um, whilst attacking him, he might summon those rocks again. Um, you know, because you s he usually summons them whilst you're stationary. So if you sort of start hitting him, he might summon those rocks to fall on you. So you just make sure move out the way when he raises his arms and, you know, screams. And that's it really. Yeah, just got one epic drop from him. That's uh, Tunjin Cham. It's not really that good. I mean, as you can see here, I selected the two things that's really good, just cold and lightning resistance. Uh, the rest of it is just pretty much for strictly builds to do with cold damage. I hope you've enjoyed this incredibly short fight. Bye bye and um, remember to request some more boss fights if you need them.